Whoopi goes walkies. <laughs> ah, go! <laughs> Please try and hold still so I can measure you. <laughs> that tickles, Max. <laughs> it makes me laugh. <laughs> That's because monster math measuring is so much fun. <laughs> Sorry, Lily. The scream screen always surprises me. <laughs> I like surprises. <laughs> the scream screen! Somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the, the monster mascot will be there! It's Mr. Cranky Pants Monster. Hi! Fooey, I'm very cranky today. <laughs> Mr. Cranky Pants Monster is always very cranky. How can we help? I'm going to my nephew's party. A party? Oh, I love parties! I don't. They make me cranky. And you want the Monster Mask Squad to cheer you up? No. I like being cranky. I need you to walk my pet monster, Woofy, while I'm gone. Oh, we can do that. You might be surprised, Goo. Woofy is very, very, very hard to walk. Nothing's too hard for the Monster Mask Squad. We'll see. Hmm. We need to walk an unwalkable pet monster. I'm sure we can use some monster math to do that. Yeah, because monster math is everywhere. Hey, will you join the monster math squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Great. First, we need the secret monster math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Word monster! monster. Today's secret monster math word is shape. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Shape! <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, okay, Lily. Come on, Monster Math Squad. Let's go watch Woofy. Cranky Pants Monster. <laughs> it's about time you monsters got here. I'm gonna be late for the party. Whoa, look at all the doors. Which one is Woofy's? Wait, don't leave yet. Where's Woofy? Woofy's behind the round door with the square shaped knob. Ah! Ah! Did you see Word Monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word, shape. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One. Two, three, shape! Look, a monster math monitor. Three little monsters hairy. Round, triangle, and squarey. Three little shapes who look like apes. Round, triangle, and squarey. Round, triangle, and square are all math words. We must need to know them to help us walk Woofy. Mr. Cranky Pants Monster said that to find Woofy, we have to find a round door with a square-shaped knob. Okay, Monster Math Squad! Let's do Monster Math! We need to find a door that's round, like this shape, with a knob that's square, like this. That one! It's round! Aw, cute! <laughs> Silly monsters! That door is round, but so is the knob. Remember, Mr. Cranky Pants Monster said that Woofy is behind a round door with a square knob. Do you see it? Yes! That door is round, and it has a square knob! We found Woofy! <laughs> Good job, squad! We, we did, did the, the math. math! We did, did the monster math! math. Oh. I'll walk, Woofy! Whoa. Whoa. I'm stuck! Here, up! Oh. Oh, hey. oh. Mr. Cranky Pants Monster did say Woofy is very, very, very hard to walk. Now we know why. He's 
sticky. Look! A chew toy. Maybe Woofy likes to play fetch. That'll get him going. <laughs> That's not a chew toy. It's another pet monster. Follow those monsters! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Where's Woofy? Excuse me, um, I can point to where Woofy went, but uh, you'll need to put me back together again so I have something to point with. This must be Falls Apart Monster. Or at least his mouth. He falls apart all the time, poor guy. Let's put him back together! Does this piece go here or there? Uh, could you maybe try again? If we knew what Falls Apart Monster is supposed to look like, I bet we could put him back together again. Look! A monster math monitor! It's a picture of Falls Apart Monster. Hmm. Falls Apart Monster is made up of different shapes. There are round shapes and a square shape and a triangle shape. Come on, squad! Let's match the pieces and put Falls Apart Monster back together again! Let's do Monster Math! Let's start with his body. Do you remember what shape it is? It's square! Now, let's find the square piece. Do you see the square? There! Now let's find his eyes! What shape are they? Yes! They're round! Let's look for two round pieces. There! Way to use your eyes, squad! Now let's find his horn. What shape is it? Uh, a pointy thing? Do you remember the name of that shape? Triangle, yes! Hmm, where is the triangle piece? Oh, I see it! He's almost back together again. Oh, I'll put on his other parts. Hmm, something still seems to be missing. What is it? Oh, right. His nose. <laughs> That's a funny looking nose. It is an unusual shape. Ah! Ah! Did you just see word monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word, shape, together again. On three. Ready? One, two, three. Shape! A monster math monitor. Four little monsters, Harry. Round, triangle, star, and squarey. Four little shapes who look like apes. Round, triangle, star, and squarey. Now we know the nose is in the shape of a star. Hmm, we need to find a piece that's shaped like a star. Let's look for it. You see it? Where? Oh, there. <laughs> Here you go, Falls Apart Monster. One star nose coming up. Oh, thank you. We put Falls Apart Monster back together again. Way to go, Monster Math Squad. We, we did, did the, the math. math. We did the Monster, monster Math. math. <laughs> now can you tell us where Woofy went? Woofy was heading for the park. Uh, uh, that way. <laughs> Thanks, Falls Apart Monster. Come on, squad. Let's get that pet. Bye-bye. <laughs> What's wrong, little monster? We were having a party when a big sticky monster came racing by and everything stuck to it. <gasps> that sounds like Woofy! Oh, where is he? We don't know. Party, balloons, phooey! Hey, aren't you monsters supposed to be walking Woofy? Um, we have something to tell you about Woofy. <laughs> what is it? I'm already late for the party. Woofy! Uh, we just wanted to tell you that... Woofy had a great walk. That's not Woofy. That's Sticky. Never take him for a walk. 
He sticks to everything. But if that's sticky, where's Woofy? <laughs> that's Woofy. <laughs> Oops, I burst the balloon. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Maybe I like parties after all. Well, at least Woofy got his walk. But now the poor little party monsters have no balloons to play with. Look! I'm a balloon! <laughs> but you're a triangle, Goo! Balloons are round, like a circle. Oh! Right! <laughs> <laughs> well done, Monster Math Squad! We walked Woofy and saved the party! And we did it by knowing all about round, triangle, star, and square shapes. That deserves a great big monster howl! On three! One, two, three, no! We, we did, did the math! We, we did, did the monster, monster math! <laughs> Number muncher monster. <laughs> Look, Lily, I made goo into the number one. I'm number one! I'm number one! Woohoo! Ah! Ah! I'm number two? <laughs> the scream screen always surprises Goo. The scream screen! Somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the, the Monster, monster Mask Squad will be there! It's Miss Merkley. She bakes monster muffins in her muffin shop. Monster muffins are slimy and grimy and my favorite snack. Monster muffins are my favorite slimy, grimy snack, too. Well, it so happens I'm about to bake a fresh batch of my monster muffins. Yum! But there's a problem. What? Numbers are missing from my scale, and I can't weigh my muffin ingredients properly. We can help. Math is all about numbers. Yeah! Because Monster Math is everywhere! Thanks, Monster Math Squad! See you soon! Hey, will you join the Monster Math Squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Monster Math! Terrific! First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done! Ah, ah, word Monster! Today's secret Monster Math word is... Count! Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen! Count! <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, I knew that. <laughs> Come on, squad. Let's find Miss Merkley's missing numbers. <laughs> Monster Math Squad? <gasps> monster monster muffin! muffin! I only have one Monster Muffin left. I really need to bake some more. But I can't if my scale is missing numbers. There do seem to be some numbers missing. But I can't figure out which ones. I really need your help to count them. <laughs> Did you see Word Monster? That means we all need to shout the secret Monster Math word, count! Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three, count! Look, it worked! A monster math monitor. Monster one, doing math. Monster two, in a bath. Monster three, with purple toes. Monster four, with a polka dot nose. Monster five, making a face. Monster six, tying her shoelace. Monster seven, holding a cat. Monster 8, wearing a hat. Monster 9, in a dress. Monster 10, making a mess. 10 monsters. Cool. Now that we know how the numbers go from 1 to 10, we can find out which of those numbers are missing from Miss Merkley's scale. Let's do monster math! math. Oh. What's the first number? One! The number one is still on the scale. It's not missing. What number's next? One, two, right. Is that number on the scale? I see it! <laughs> this is fun! <laughs> oh, what's after two? One, two, huh, what comes next? Yes, three! 
Number three is missing. We need the number three. I'll make the missing numbers out of icing. Just until we find the real ones. <laughs> Good thinking, Miss Merkley. The next number is also missing from the scale. Help us count the numbers we have so far. One, two, three. What's next? Four. Yay! There's a number five. And six. And seven on the scale. But the next number is missing. Which number is next? Eight! We're doing great! The scale has number nine. And ten! Do we have all the numbers from one to ten now? Let's count them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Yes! We found all the missing numbers on Miss Merkley's scale. Way to go, squad! We did the math! We did the monster math! Well, we didn't exactly find the numbers. We only found out what numbers are missing. We still need to get the real numbers back on so the scale will work properly. In the meantime, you can have my last muffin. Yay! No time for snacks, squad. Aww. We need to find those missing numbers. Did you see anything unusual in your shop, Miss Merkley? Well, there was a suspicious-looking monster lurking around here earlier. He was kind of big and blue and, uh, oh, yes! He had a large mouth with three huge teeth. Big, blue, three huge teeth. Let's see if this monster math monitor can help us out. Just as I suspected, it's Number Muncher Monster. Ah! Oh, who's that? Is he scary? No, but Number Muncher Monster does love to eat numbers. Come on, squad. We need to find Number Muncher Monster and get Miss Merkley's numbers back before he eats them. I don't see Number Muncher Monster anywhere. Hey, it's Smooth Moves Monster. He knows all the moves. Maybe he knows where we need to move to find Number Muncher Monster. Where do monsters need to move? Listen to Smooth, get in the groove. Boogie Oogie Oogie, it's Monstrovia Town Square. The numbers you're looking for, well, I'll be there. Listen for 10 sounds all in a row. Then spin around, look up, and you'll find them, yo. How will we know when we hear 10 sounds all in a row? Well, I suppose when you hear the sounds, you could count them. Did you see Word Monster? Monster math terrific! Let's shout the secret monster math word, count, together again. On three. Ready? One, two, three, count! A monster math monitor! Monster one doing math. Monster two in a bath. Monster three with purple toes. Monster four with a polka dot nose. Monster five making a face. Monster six tying her shoelace. Monster seven holding a cat. Monster eight wearing a hat. Monster nine in a dress. Monster 10 making a mess. 10 monsters! Thanks, Monster Math Monitor. Reminding us how the numbers go from 1 to 10 will really help us count 10 sounds in a row, like Smooth Move said to. Let's boogie oogie oogie to Monstrovia Town Square. Hmm. Smooth Move's monster said we needed to listen for 10 sounds all in a row. Hmm. What makes sounds? Do you see that? It's a squawk monster. Squawk monsters love to make loud squawks. We need to get ready to count out the number of squawks it makes. Get ready to count with us. That's one squawk. Let's keep counting out the number of monster squawks we hear. Two. Two three. Four. Five. He's flown away after five squawks. Is that enough sounds? What do you think? You're right, it's not. We're listening for 10 sounds all in a row. Is there anything else that might make a sound? The clock makes sounds when it chimes the hour. And it looks like it's almost 10 o'clock. Time to chime.
Okay, Monster Math Squad, get ready to count out the number of clock chimes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Way to go, Squad! Smooth Moves Monster said that when we hear ten sounds in a row, we have to spin around and look up. Let's all spin around and look up. Look, it's Number Muncher Monster. And in his bucket, he's got Miss Merkley's numbers. I bet he's going to grab more numbers from the clock to munch. But then we'll never know what time it is in Monstrovia. Hey, Number Muncher Monster, can you please not eat the numbers? Number Muncher Monster loves munchy crunchy numbers. I know exactly how you feel. I love slimy, grimy monster muffins. What are slimy, grimy monster muffins? This is a slimy, grimy monster muffin. Hmm. That does look slimy and grimy. Would you like to try it? Number Muncher Monster will try an incy weensy bite. <laughs> Yummy! Number Muncher Monster loves slimy, grimy monster muffins. No! <laughs> oh! Well, no monster muffin. Wait! There's a crumb left! Oh, yay! Oh. <laughs> Silly monsters. <laughs> we found all the missing numbers from Miss Merkley's scale by knowing how to count from one to ten. Now she can bake lots of monster muffins. That deserves a big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Oh. We, we did, did the math! math. We, we did, did the monster, monster map! <laughs> <laughs> Missing monster house. <laughs> Look, Lily, I made goo bigger. I'm a big monster now. <laughs> I'm small again. <laughs> the scream screen always surprises goo. The Scream Screen! <laughs> Somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care... The, the Monster Mask Squad will be there! Hey, it's Mrs. Huge Horn Monster. Thank goodness you're there, Monster Math Squad. My monster house is missing. Oh, that's strange. I know, Max. I went shopping this morning, and when I returned home, my house was gone! Don't worry, I'm sure we can find your house by using Monster Math. Yeah! Monster Math can solve any problem! Because, because Monster, Monster Math, Math is everywhere. everywhere! I knew I could count on you, Monster Math Squad. See you soon! Hey, will you join the Monster Math Squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Cool! First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Word monster! monster! Today's secret monster math word is size. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Size! <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, right. Come on, squad. Let's find the missing monster house. Mrs. Huge Horn Monster, can you tell us what your missing house looks like? Well, why don't I show you, Max? Here's a photograph of me in front of my monster house with my darling pet, Fuzzy. Your house is very big. And your pet, Fuzzy, is very small. Oh, that tickles! No, 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 Fuzzy. Don't tickle the nice monster. Fuzzy sure looks a lot bigger than he did in this picture. Oh, yes. His fuzz has grown very long since then, hasn't it, Fuzzy? <laughs> oh, that, oh, that tickles! Oh, fuzzy! I wonder where that house went. Hey, it's Smooth Moves Monster. He knows all the moves. Do you know what moves we need to make to find the missing monster house? 
had monsters need to move? Listen to Smooth, get in the groove. Shake and shimmy to the street, then look down. Three sets of footprints will be found. You'll see small, medium, and big ones if you use your eyes. Strut your stuff and follow the ones that are medium size. Did you see Word Monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word size. Are you ready? Let's shout it together. On three. One, two, three, size! Look, it worked! A monster math monitor. A small monster on a trampoline. A small monster and a medium monster on a trampoline. A small monster and a medium monster and a big monster on a trampoline. A big monster on a trampoline. That was really helpful. Now we know all about small, medium, and big. And remember, Smooth Moves Monster said that the monster house footprints we need to find are medium size. Small, medium, and big are math words. Come on, squad, we can do this. Let's, Let's do, do monster, monster math. <laughs> Let's shake and shimmy onto the street. Come on. Look, footprints. We need to find the footprints that are medium size, not too big and not too small. Medium ones! <laughs> Which ones are they, Max? They all look kind of big compared to my foot. We need to compare all the footprints side by side. Then we'll be able to see which ones are medium. How? The footprints are far apart. Leave this to me. <laughs> hey, Monster Math Monitor. Can you take a picture of each size footprint? What's Lily doing? Now, I'll put the picture of the footprints beside each other so we can compare their sizes. Great idea, Lily! Which is the biggest? Right! I'll put the big one here. And which is the smallest? Oh, I know! That one! Is that footprint the smallest? Nope. That is! Uh, that was gonna be my next guess. <laughs> I'll put the small one here, and which one is the medium-sized footprint? That one! Medium! Yay! I'll put the medium footprint here. Do you see the footprints on the ground that look like the medium-sized footprint here? That matches! Yes! We found the missing Monster House footprints! Awesome job, squad! We, we did, did the math. math! We did the Monster Math! math. Monster said we should strut our stuff and follow the medium footprints. Well then, let's strut, squad! <laughs> Strutting is fun! Hmm, the medium footprints lead to Monster Park. So the missing monster house must be here somewhere. But I don't see it. Well, I don't see anything! The whole place is covered in yellow fur! Yellow fur? Weird. Where? Oh, it's you, Max. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> hey, what's up? It is hard to see things with all these trees in the way. Maybe we could see things better from up on that jungle gym. Jungle gym! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> 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 Silly monsters. Monster let us on the jungle gym. To climb the jungle gym, monsters must be the right size. <laughs> Did you see word monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word size together again. On three. Ready? One, two, three. Size! Look! A monster math monitor! A small monster on a skateboard. A small monster and a medium monster on a skateboard. A small monster and a medium monster, and a big monster on a skateboard. A big monster on a skateboard. It's really good to know about small, medium, and big. I wonder what size we need to be to be allowed on the jungle gym. To climb the jungle gym, you need to be medium size. You have to be above my toes and below my nose. Above his toes and below his nose. Am I the right height? What do you think? Is Goo above the gate monster's toes? Sorry, Goo. 
You're below the gate monster's toes. You're too small. Aww. Oh, oh, how about me? Is Max the right height to climb the jungle gym? Well, he's definitely above the toes. But is he below the nose? You're right. Max isn't below the gate monster's nose. He's too big. Oh. How about you, Lily? Yeah, maybe you're the right size to climb the jungle gym. What do you think? Is Lily the right size to climb the jungle gym? She has to be above the gate monster's toes and below his nose. Yes! Not too small and not too big. Lily is medium! Woohoo! Climb the jungle gym, medium Lily! Here I go! What can you see up there? I see the missing monster house. It's hidden behind those trees. Let's go, squad. Excuse me, but do you belong to Mrs. Huge Horn Monster? Yes, I do. Yay! We found you! Oh, 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 no, no, don't hug me! That tickles! Oh, no! Oh, come back! Sorry about that. Tickling makes me run. I'm very ticklish. We promise we won't tickle you again. Wait a minute. Is that why you ran away before? Because someone tickled you? Yes. Who? Well, I think it was Fuzzy. Mrs. Hugehorn Monster's pet monster? No, it couldn't have been Fuzzy tickling you. <laughs> Look at him. He's so small he couldn't tickle a flea monster. He's small in this picture. But remember when we saw him earlier with Mrs. Hugehorn Monster? I remember. Fuzzy was big. And his fuzz was super long and super tickly. So it was Fuzzy who tickled you. I thought so. If we promise that Fuzzy won't tickle you anymore, will you come home with us? But Lily, how can we promise Fuzzy won't tickle the house anymore? Leave that to me. What's she doing? She has a fuzzy clipper monster. <laughs> it loves to clip fuzz. Is that fuzzy? Yes. He got a haircut. No more big fuzz means no more tickling. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> and they all lived tickle-free ever after. Monster math -erific job, Monster Math Squad. We found the missing monster house. And we did it by knowing all about sizes, like small. That's me! Medium. That's me! And big. <laughs> That's me. That deserves a great big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> we, we did, did the math. math! We, we did, did the monster math! math. <laughs> Big monster mess! Oh, come on, yo! Look, I made two goos! And two goos are better than one! <laughs> one goo's pretty good, too. He sure is. The scream screen always surprises Goo. The scream screen. Somewhere in Monstrobia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the, the Monster, monster Mask Squad will be there. Hey, it's Mr. Cranky Pants Monster. Hi, Hi Mr. Cranky, Cranky Pants, Pants Monster. Phooey, I don't have time for chit chat. I am very cranky today. Why is that? Because that mischievous mess monster is here. Uh oh, mess monster is a really mischievous monster. Yes, and he's already messed up my monster's socks. Well, can we help you, Mr. Cranky Pants Monster? I need you to match my socks back together while I try to catch that mess monster menace. Don't worry, I'm sure we can match your socks using monster math. Yeah, monster math can solve any problem. Because because Monster Math is everywhere! Hurry! Water! Hey, will you join the Monster Math Squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Cool! First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Word Monster! Today's secret Monster Math word is... Pears. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Pears! <laughs> Not 
Yeah, Goo? Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, right. All right, squad. Let's go unmess some messed up socks. <laughs> Sort them into pairs. Come back here, you mess-making menace! <laughs> Did you see word monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word, pairs. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three, pairs! <laughs> A monster math monitor! A monster going skiing. A monster in a pair of mitts. A monster in a pair of ski boots. A monster on a pair of skis. A monster on a pair of crutches. Watch where you're going, please. That was so helpful. Now we know all about pairs. Pairs are two things that go together, like socks. Right, and pair is a math word. Come on, squad, we can do this. Let's, Let's do, do monster math. To make a pair, we need to find another sock that looks just like this one. This one? Hmm. Are these a pair? Oh, you're right. They're not. They're different colors. We need to find another sock that's red. How about this one? It's the same color. Yes! We found our first pair of monster socks. Good work, squad. Which one goes with this? A blue sock. I'll find another one just like it. Look, this one. It's blue, too. Well, they are the same color, but I don't think they look exactly the same. Uh, what's the difference? Do you see the difference? Of course. These two socks are not the same shape. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I see that now. We need to find a blue sock with this shape to make a pair. This one? Yes! We found another pair! Oh, math is fun! Let's find some more pairs! What goes with this one? Do you see it? Where? Oh, there! Yes! The same color and the same shape! <gasps> A pair! Yay! What matches this one? Oh, oh, I see it! Another pair! We're a sensational monster sock squad! I found another pair! They look exactly alike! <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> Those aren't socks, Goo. They're Max's feet. <laughs> Not socks. How about this sock? What goes with it? This one! It's the same shape and color! Hmm, but there's something different about it. What's different? Right! It has a different pattern! Oh, yeah! One has polka dots and one has stripes! We need to put these last two socks in pairs. So, what goes with them? This one goes with this one. See? Polka dots! And we have one more sock with stripes. There! Yes! We put all the pairs of monster socks together! Awesome job, squad! We, we did the math! math. We, we did, did the, the monster math! math. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't done all the math! Mess monster just messed up all my horn hoots! Uh, what's a hootie horn? Uh, I mean, a uh, hootie who? What? Follow me! Horned hoots. There. Aw, cute. Except Mess Monster let them all out of their pens. Now we need you to catch them and put them back. Well, that sounds simple enough. We won't even need math to do that. Put two in each pen. Two? Ugh, maybe we will need math. Go, Mess Monster! Okay, squad. Let's put these hootie things back in their pens. Two in each pen. 
Share their pens in matching pairs. <laughs> Did you just see word monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word pairs together again. On three. Ready? One, two, three. Pairs! <gasps> A monster math monitor. A pair of monsters with two noses. A pair of monsters with three toeses. A pair of monsters who slurp. A pair of monsters who burp. <laughs> Manners, monsters, please. <laughs> Thanks, Math Monitor. It's great to know about different kinds of pairs. I think that will really help us put these horned hoots into pairs. Let's, Let's do, do Monster, Monster Math! Math. Hmm, a pair are two things that go together. So which horned hoots look like they go together? Let's do this together, squad. What hoot looks like it makes a pair with this one? This one? What do you think? Do these horned hoots make a pair? <laughs> There's something different about them. Oh, I see. They have a different number of horns. One has two horns and the other has three. Are there other hoots with the same number of horns? I see a two-horned hoot. And I see a three-horned hoot. Grab them! <laughs> oh, frisky little critters. There, two perfect pairs. Into the pens you go. They're not escaping. That means they're pairs and like to share the same pen. <laughs> All the rest of the hoots look exactly the same. Then let's put two in each pen. One, two. One, two. Oh, they're hopping out. They're not happy. They must not be in matching pairs after all. There must be something about the horned hoots that's not the same. But what could it be? Oh, I can't think with all this noisy hooting. Wait a minute. Hooting! Everyone, listen very carefully to the hoots. Do you hear that? Something is different about the hoots. They sound different? Yes! That must be it. These hoots make different sounds. So all we have to do to put them in pairs is... I know! Teach them to hoot the same way! <laughs> or put the ones who hoot the same way in pairs. Oh, uh, I guess you could do that too. Okay, which of the other hoots sound like this one? <laughs> that one! It sounds the same! Let's find out if they really are a pair. Yes! A perfect pair of horned hoots! And these two hoots sound the same, so they're a pair! We put all the horned hoots in pairs! Yeah! <laughs> well, I finally got this mess-making mess monster! And we put your monster socks and horned hoots together! And we did it by knowing all about pairs! That deserves a great big monster howl! On three! One, two, three! Oh! We, we did, did the, the math. math! We, we did, did the, the monster math! math. <laughs> <laughs> Garbage Monster delivers! There, Goo! We've sorted all your monster suckers into two piles. Icky ones and sticky ones. Yum! <laughs> Thanks, Max! Uh... Which ones are which again? Ah! 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 
This is definitely a sticky monster sucker. <laughs> the scream screen always surprises Goo. The scream screen! Oh, somewhere in Monstrobia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the, the monster, monster mascot will be there! It's Garbage Monster! Hi! Howdy ho, Monster Math Squad! I need your help, I indeedy do. Well, what can we Monster Math doodly do for you? Well, as you know, I deliver garbage to Monstrovia. Yes, sirree! Monsters love getting garbage. And I love delivering heaps of it. But right now, I can't. No, sirree. No, oh, why not? There's a new law in town. All garbage must be delivered into the right bins. Well, uh... So what's the problem? I have no idea what garbage to put into what bin. I'm freaking out! Don't worry, Garbage Monster. The Monster Math Squad is on the job. Goody good. See you soon. Hmm. Figuring out what garbage to put in which bin. I'm sure we could use some Monster Math to do that. Yeah, because Monster Math is everywhere. Hey. Will you join the Monster Math Squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! <laughs> you will! Yes! First, we need the secret monster math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Hey, monster! monster! Today's secret monster math word is... Sort. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Sort. <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, okay, Lily. Come on, Monster Math Squad. Let's go help deliver some garbage. <laughs> Monster, let's have a look at these new garbage bins. Hmm, there are two bins outside this house. But I cannot, no siree, figure out what garbage to sort into them. Ah! Ah! Did you see Word Monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word sort. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three, sort! Look, it worked! A monster math! A monster sorting monster marbles. Red monster marbles. Blue monster marbles. Monster marbles that blink. Monster marbles that wink. A monster sorting monster marbles. Thanks, Monster Math Monitor. It seems things can be sorted in all sorts of ways. Yeah, like by how they look. Yes. I bet we need to know about sorting to help us figure out what garbage goes in which bins. And since sorting is math, let's, let's do monster math! math. Oh. Uh, what do those pictures on the bins mean? Hmm, they look like old jars. I know who lives here, Sauce Monster. She makes her famous monster slime sauce and puts it in jars. Her red slime sauce goes in red jars, and her blue slime sauce goes in blue jars. Mmm! I can smell the slime sauce from here! <gasps> Look! One bin has a picture of a blue jar, and the other has a picture of a red jar. So, uh, what are we supposed to do? Oh, I think it means we have to sort all the red jars into this bin, and all the blue jars into that one. Okay, then. Where to begin? Let's start by sorting out all of the jars from the rest of the garbage. Come on, squad! Help us sort! Jars go in this pile, and everything else stays in the truck. <laughs> Let's get sorting! How about this? Where does it go? Into the jar pile! Yay! We're sorting stuff! Two more jars! Another one. Oh, right. That's not a jar. Silly monster me. Oh. Uh, so where does it go? Back in the truck. Right. <laughs> Thanks. In the truck or on the pile? Jar pile. I think we found all the slime sauce jars. Now what do we do? Now we need to sort them into two different piles. Red jars and blue jars. 
Red jars go in this pile. And blue jars in this pile. Any other colors can go back in the truck. Here's a red jar! <laughs> Which pile? Oh, yeah! The red jar pile! <laughs> Thanks! Hmm, what about this jar? Right, the blue pile. Sorting is sort of fun. Come on, squad. Let's sort the rest of the jars. Where does this one go? Yes, into the blue pile with you. Hey, I found a jar with some goopy monster sauce still in it. <laughs> no, go. Never eat garbage. Yuck, yuck. Especially old slime sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, yuck! What do we do with the jar? I know! Don't eat it! <laughs> it's not red or blue, so it goes... Oh, oh, I know, I know! Back in the truck! How about these? Right! Red again! One last jar! Which pile? We've sorted all the slime sauce jars. Let's put them in their bins and then we're done. <laughs> Fun. All sorted, squad. We, we did, did the, the math. math. We, we did, did the monster, monster math. math. <gasps> Wait a monstery moment. We're not done yet. I have one more stop. Barks and Stench General Store. Come on, Monster Math Squad! There's more garbage to sort! Well, here we are, Barks and Stench General Store. These bins have really weird pictures on them. Let me look. Ew, that is weird. What are we supposed to sort into them? I'm losing my monster mind! I heard something. Did you just see Word Monster? Then let's shout out the secret monster math word sort together again. On three. Ready? One, two, three, sort! Ooh, a monster math monitor! <laughs> They're cool! A monster sorting monster gumballs into slippery monster gumballs, sticky monster gumballs, smelly monster gumballs, really smelly monster gumballs. A monster sorting monster gumballs. Thanks, Monster Math Monitor. That was really helpful. It seems you can sort stuff even by how it smells or feels. Hmm, do you think knowing that will help us sort the garbage into these bins? Well, let's see. This bin looks like it has something pretty slimy on it. And this one looks pretty stinky. Maybe we need to sort the garbage into slimy stuff for this bin and stinky stuff for this bin. We can do this job, squad. Sorting is math, so let's, let's do, do monster, monster math! math. Oh! Come on, squad. Help us sort slimy and stinky garbage. Slimy stuff goes in this bin and stinky stuff in this one. Everything else stays in the truck. What's this look like? Slimy? Okay. Which bin? Right. Thanks. <laughs> I'll do it. Whoa! <laughs> Super slimy. Any stinky things? How about this? Smell it. Not stinky. Is it slimy? No. It's not stinky or slimy, so where should it go? Right, back in the truck. Okay, let's find something stinky or slimy. An old monster sock! Ew! That smells really bad. Which bin? Stinky? Slimy? Ew! <laughs> right! <laughs> Thanks! Definitely stinky! <laughs> I'm a super stinky sorter! <laughs> got a Slimer! Which bin? You got it! <laughs> Thanks! Got a stinker! 
we sorted all the stinky and slimy stuff. Look, it's Mr. Cranky Pants Monster. Why would anyone want old stinky and slimy things anyway? I like to take a bath in stinky and slimy stuff. It makes me extra cranky, and I love being cranky. <laughs> <laughs> we know. Thanks for helping me deliver my garbage, Monster Mask Squad. Yes, sir. And we did it by knowing all about sorting. That deserves a great big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Howl! We, we did, did the math. math. We, we did, did the, the monster math. math. <laughs> <laughs>